Hey friends, it's me, and welcome to writing today. Apparently Tibbs is joining us. There she goes right in front. Um, so I kind of need to figure out today which of my titles I'm going to make to be my story. And usually when I choose what I'm going to make my story, I ask my class to help me. But since we're all at home, I don't have my class to help me. So I have assembled a class of stuffed animals that are going to help me because they have a lot of brains and I only have one and so they should be able to help me. From the left we have Scorch, then we have the Cheshire Cat, then we have King Julian from Madagascar, then we have Despero, and we have Perry the Platypus, in the back is Mushu from Mulan, and on the very end is my favorite, that is Polar. So they're going to help listen to my ideas today and help me decide which idea is best for writing. So, my first idea was The Dynamos Become Spies. That's a really good title. But I can't really think of anything that we would be spying on. Like, usually in my books there's like a bad guy, and then we spy on the bad guy. But I haven't really thought of a bad guy for my books. So I don't know if the dynamos become spies is a good idea because I really can't think about that much about it. So I'm going to say that I'll probably cross that off my list. My next idea is the dynamos and the best blizzard ever. And in this story, the dynamos are going to go to the store like they're shopping. And maybe they're shopping for like holiday gifts. And while they're shopping for holiday gifts, it starts snowing outside and the snow gets deeper and deeper and deeper and you would think that the dynamos would get stuck at the store shopping because of the blizzard but they don't because the dynamos are smart and they buy snowmobiles and sleds and pogo sticks and then they tie the sleds onto the snowmobiles and then ride all the way home with the sleds attached which would be a super awesome story I know it needs some more details, but I'm going to keep that on the list because I think it's a pretty good story. My next idea is the Dynamo's run for president. Um, I don't really have a lot of ideas about that, except the Dynamo's would be awesome as president. And we could take over the White House, which would be amazing because it has 32 bathrooms. Everybody could have their own bathroom. Plus, we'd have extras. Um, so even though that sounds like a really good story, I really can't think of anything to go with it, so I think I'm going to cross that off my list too. And then my last idea is the dynamos and the castle challenge. So I really want the dynamos to like get a castle because that would be awesome that we could live in the castle and we could have school in the castle and have all kinds of adventures in the castle. So I was thinking that maybe the dynamos find a castle that's for sale. But to be able to buy the castle, the dynamos need like a ton of money. And the dynamos don't have a ton of money. So they get involved in some kind of a challenge that they have to get through in the castle. Where they have to find a certain number of like hidden passages or hidden money or something like that and then after they do that um, they can like either buy the castle or they can win the castle and then we turn the castle into like the ultimate castle. So I think I'm going to keep that on my list because that's a pretty good idea too. So. I got the dynamos and the best blizzard ever and the dynamos and the castle challenge. So what I need to do is I need to really think really hard about both of those stories and decide which one I really want to write. I think I really want to write the castle challenge story so I think that's the one I'm going to pick. So now what I need to do for writing today since I picked with the help of my friends that were listening to me. Now what I need to do is I need to think up about the story in my head. Like what's going to happen first, what's going to happen next, what's going to happen after that. So I can get the story in order so then I'll be ready to write. 
Okay, so your job today in writing is to figure out which story you're going to write. Then you need to get some listening ears, like I did. I got some stuffed animals. And you need to talk to them about all your ideas and decide which story you're going to write. Then you need to spend the rest of the time brainstorming, which means coming up with lots of ideas in your brain, to figure out what's going to happen in your story. Like what's going to happen first, what's going to happen next, what's going to happen after that. So you know exactly what's going to happen in your story. So you'll be ready to write. You're not doing any writing today. We are brainstorming today. Okay? Happy brainstorming. See you guys later.